Hello and welcome to this video where we're going to cover reporting in the standard edition of Nagios XI. Now, Nagios XI has two editions. There's a standard edition and an enterprise edition. And as it regards reporting, the enterprise edition has two additional reports and one additional feature. We're going to explain those in more detail in the next video. In this video, we're going to cover reporting in the standard edition. All right, here we are. We're in the Nagios XI interface. We're on the reports page. Now let's talk about which reports are available in the standard edition. That is going to be the availability report, executive summary, state history, top alert producers, alert histogram, notifications, event log, and bandwidth usage. They're all going to be very similar, but they do show different things. So let's take a look at each one. Availability summary, as we touched on in the introductory video, it is going to reflect state history and state data. And you can choose a time period, you can limit it, um, there's advanced features. The availability summary, fairly straightforward. The executive summary is a grouping of different reports all put together. So you've got availability, you also have top alert producers. You have the alert histogram and latest alerts. All of those together comprise the executive summary report. State history. Here is now here's something that's a little bit different about the state history report is you can see that I've clicked in this search function and that's going to allow you to see a little bit different take on the data. So if you put in a search term here, then you can get, you know, state data for localhost or um, any number of things that you might put in. You might put in 192. You could check out state data on uh, our switch 5.41. So that's a handy thing. Otherwise, a lot of that stuff is going to be the same. And when we go to top alert producers, this really is the, this is our problem children here. These are the, the services and the hosts that have the most alerts. And here's what's going on. This is a great one to pay a lot of attention to because generally one of the first things we need to pay attention to is what isn't working. So this is going to have very similar, um, very similar options to the other reports that we have available. The alert histogram. This can really tell you um, if there is a time of day, it looks like right about seven o'clock, right until the early afternoon. That's when we seem to be having the most challenges with the hosts that we're monitoring with our demo machine here. We get to notifications. Similarly, we get a search box in notifications, just like we did for state history. So again, we can narrow this by that and of course you could uh, make this one this one slice could be you know notifications on dot five dot forty one that could be a report that we could save then we go to the event log event log is another one with the search function so you can narrow it not only by that we could make it you know service notification and so we can skin it just that way. From there, we can take a look at the bandwidth usage. This is a great report. So anything that you have monitored using the network switch router wizard, this is gonna give you the bandwidth reporting that you're looking for. Here's what's cool about bandwidth reporting is you can select a section, you can zoom in and you can continue to refine, look more closely, do all those sorts of things. So you've got all those options. And then again, right here, as we saw in the intro video, you can download each of these individually, any of these charts in this way. And of course you can download the whole report as a CSV, a PDF, or a JPEG. That's a quick spin through the reports that are included with the Nagios XI Standard Edition. Stay tuned to find out what you can do with the Enterprise Edition and reporting. Thank you.